Hey everyone, my name is Lisa Ann and today you'll be learning how to get clients through lead magnets. Being an entrepreneur is an amazing experience. However, it's not a walk in the park. You will face challenges and setbacks as you continue to succeed. And with several competitors, how do you stand out and succeed? How do you find those returning clients in a world where the customer is actually king? There is so much uncertainty when it comes to getting clients. However, they're an integral part of your business. Clients are the life force of your business. Without them, you would have no product or service to offer. Your clients may come from various sources, through sponsored ads, through referrals, heck, even through hashtags. However, you need, you need to make the effort to get clients. And this is where a lead magnet can come in. A lead is a person who shows interest in your product or service. Usually, a lead does not start out as a buyer. A lead could be someone who has subscribed to your email list, reads it weekly, and over time, this person becomes a buyer. A lead magnet is simply a way of attracting potential clients. A lead magnet is a free offer or an incentive that you make in exchange for client's contact information. This information is usually a name and an email address. A lead magnet is essentially bait for potential customers, but one that will benefit both parties. Traditional means of getting clients are becoming obsolete. While we still have giant billboards mounted in major locations, most companies, including mega companies, they've taken their business online. Why? Because everyone is on their phone. You're on your phone. Your neighbor is on his phone. We're a generation addicted to our gadgets. The addiction is the perfect way to market your product or services to your clients. And through your free offer, you can show your potential clients what your business is all about. As a travel company, for example, you can offer a free, well-detailed ebook about all the different cool spots to see in Paris. By reading this ebook, your clients trust that you're knowledgeable and they're likely to sign up for your tour packages. People want solutions to their problems. And by dangling a lead magnet in front of them, which solves their problems, they learn to trust you. Even if they don't work with you right now, they will either make referrals and they are likely to come back to work with you in the future. Now, by offering them an incentive that solves their problems, you build a long lasting relationship with your clients. And ads cost money. And as a business owner, you want value for your money spent. The aim is to have a high conversion rate to turn clicks into sales. And with lead magnets, you are reaching out to people who are not only interested in your business, but are also ready to invest in the sales. There are several lead magnets and they can be targeted at different genders, ages, races, interests, behaviors, you name it. Your lead magnet could be an ebook. Now with ebooks, you educate your clients in detail form showing them how skilled you are. Your ebook can have images to create a mental picture in the minds of your clients. This lead magnet works best if you have an audience that likes to read. Guides are also a popular lead magnet. They are similar to ebooks, but they are much shorter and they're filled with valuable information that can help your customer make choices regarding your business or your industry specifically. Oftentimes, these are referred to as white paper. I've seen people offer things like the ultimate guide to baking a cake, as well as things like a bonus pack. A great way to implement a bonus pack is if you're covering something in your blog post, let's say. You could offer an additional information in a separate PDF file. Now, you've already got them hooked at this point, so why not offer them just a little bit more? Especially if you can provide a lot of valuable information, it's certainly worth the effort to go all out with your lead magnet. Now, if you're not sure about that method, other examples could include checklists, templates, cheat sheets, workbooks, PDFs, video series, webinars, you name it. Now, videos demand a lot more effort and experience than most lead magnets, but they are definitely really effective. They appeal to the auditory and visual senses for your clients, getting across your message a lot faster. Through videos, your clients get to see the face or the faces behind your business, creating trust in your business. You can also consider a video series or even a mini course as well. Now, does your business offer memberships? You could offer a trial to your clients so they get an experience of what memberships with your business actually look like. It could be a seven day trial or longer. You just have to think it through for your business specifically. 
Now for consultants or service-based businesses, your version of this would be a free consultation with you or someone on your team. Quizzes and surveys, they're pretty cool. They tend to be engaging for clients who are eager to know how they scored. Results can be sent to the participants' email addresses. Now, just like videos, webinars have become a favorite of clients. A live webinar presents an opportunity for businesses to be asked questions about their products and services. To access a webinar link, clients must provide their email address and their name, which is a successful attempt at a lead magnet. Everyone loves free things. Some people have actually made it part of the daily routine to scan for coupon codes before they even make a purchase. Heck, they've actually made apps for that. Now, even if you're not a retailer, offering discounts is always a sure way to make people go from no to a maybe. And as for giveaways, they're definitely effective. Just be sure to do your research and remember to set up content rules in terms. Now, there are five factors you should consider when making your lead magnet. Factor number one is choosing an audience. Your lead magnet should be specific and targeted at a particular audience. Do not make the mistake of trying to attract several audiences with one lead magnet. People are diverse. So by choosing your audience, you can easily choose a suitable lead magnet to draw them in. Trial memberships may be a great lead magnet for the professional audience. Now factor number two is identifying your client's problems. Your clients have problems and questions and they need answers and solutions. And they are on a prowl for a product or a service to fill in that gap. So by identifying the issues your clients have, you can create a lead magnet that will provide a solution. As a camera salesman, let's say, you may discover that your audience is confused about the right cameras for vlogging. By identifying this problem, you can provide a lead magnet with all the different content of different cameras. You will be the first business they think of when it's time for them to purchase their camera. Now number three is deciding on the lead magnet. You have decided on your audience, you know their problem, now it's time for you to choose your lead magnet. What lead magnet best aligns with your business? Now, if you are in the food industry, an ebook or video might be a good lead magnet. A webinar might be a good lead magnet for a financial company. Once you choose your lead magnet, factor number four comes down to creating the content. Now, depending on your chosen lead magnet, this can be demanding. Creating content will require research on your end just to make sure that you're providing valuable information and the right information to your audience. Now, I highly recommend using the program Canva, so canva.com, for any graphic designs you need. Their templates honestly just make creating content so, so easy. Now, if you're thinking of making videos, something like I do, some great apps that I use are ScreenFlow if you want to record your screen, or InShot Video are really good for making reels and such. Lastly, now that your lead magnet has been created, offer it to your audience. You can offer it through a pop-up on your website, sending it through your already existing email list, or promoting it through social media, both organic and paid methods. The goal is to let people know your free offer is now available. You want to keep the process simple if you want to increase the amount of people who download or get access to your lead magnet. Name, email, that's all you need. With the success of your lead magnet, there will be responses to your call to action, leading to the sales of your products and your services. Now, lead magnets, they're an effective way to attract clients in a growing digital world. By now, you should have an idea of what lead magnet is suitable for your audience and how to go about creating one. Although, if you still think you could use some help in this area, as a digital marketing strategist, I'm here to help you with whatever you need. If this video helped you better understand what lead magnets are and gave you some good ideas on how to create a solid lead magnet for your audience, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. And if you're feeling really generous, be sure to subscribe to my channel for more content on how to get the most out of your marketing in the online world. But besides that, I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now.